get better. And the biggest thing is every day we just have to get better. Not looking at anything else, but that day we have to get better. And they kind of challenge each other. That's what I like about it. Hey, Coach. Obviously, LaDamian got recruited to kind of this level out of high school. So not maybe not the traditional Juco kid in that route. But what do you think it is about him that's allowed him to really hit the ground running here after kind of making that transition? I think the biggest thing with Coach Lavelle offense, uh, how important the running back position is on, you know, throughout uh, the scheme of things. And I think this guy just, he embraced it. Whatever it is, it's blocking, catching the ball, running the ball, whatever we need him to do. I mean, even special teams, you know, it's, he's a football player. And uh, he, he thinks he can play on any level. And obviously, when you see that on Saturday, he's a kid who can do it. Hey, Coach, just going back to Webb, just uh, I know he's coming off a 100-yard game on Saturday. Just what what do you see as far as potentially how, how great do you think he could be in the long run? Well, I think the sky's the limit just because of the way he approached things. Uh, his biggest thing is he's trying to find a way to get better. He wants to be Coach Hall, and uh, that's one thing I do like about the room, and especially Webb. He wants you to correct him on things. Uh, if he's doing something wrong, he continues to watch tape. You know, even after practice, he'll come up here later when we're in the office. You know, Coach, what do I need to improve on? Did I do this right? Were my steps right on this? Uh, when I block, uh, when my hands inside. So continue to grow daily, man. This, this, the sky's the limit for this young man. He's going to continue to get better. You know, Mike mentioned the, the confidence that's starting to build with this team. I mean, for you guys as coaches, you're obviously confident in what you're doing and, and Coach Norvell's approach. But what does it do for you as a coach when you see these players starting to gain confidence? And I guess how fulfilling is it for you to, to see that happen? Well, that's the reason you get into coaching. Uh, you see kids and, uh, and, and obviously a lot of other people don't understand the process of this. And it's going to take a while. But I enjoy the process, watching kids go from one step to the next step, and they continue to grow. And these kids are working extremely hard for us. Um, and I know a lot of times, you know, certain wins and losses don't show that, but these kids are doing a great job. We're going to continue to build them up, do the things that need, we need to do to have them committed. And right now, we're just really trying to focus on the little things, and they're doing the same thing with day in and day out of practice. Like the okay. How much um... – does Jordan being able to do what he does, how much does that help the, the backs? I think that's that's an added feature when you have a quarterback uh, with that type of athletic ability. Uh, he's another player with the ball in his hand, extremely scary. And uh, We watched him on LaDamian long run. For him to go all the way down there, we're not telling him to block. It just kind of shield people off. <laughs> we need him on the field. But, I mean, he's just an added bonus and another dangerous uh, person on the field who can throw the ball and run the ball. Hey, Coach, I realize you can't speak about specific recruits, but, you know, curious with a big win like that on Saturday, what, what does that kind of do as far as just helping sell what you guys are trying to build, build here? Obviously, you can't bring in a prospect. You can't go out and visit schools, but what can that do for the program? I think that's major. That's, that's the momentum you're looking for. That's one of your major recruiting points. You have to win it. You know, in order to get big time kids, they're looking to come to a winning program. So uh, we let them know that we're heading in the right direction, but they want to see wins. And uh, that was really big for us to go against a quality opponent uh, like North Carolina. And obviously, you know, the recruits been calling and texting and they were excited about it. So to have it played on uh, national television and everybody getting a chance to see you play, that's what you want. All right. Thank you. All right. Thank you.